Well, now this follow up tonight, a small Atala County town is questioning whether a weekend chase and fatal shooting are a hate crime. Sheriff's Department officials met with residents to answer questions about the killing of Cedric Sharkey. Rosalyn Anderson has more. More than 125 people crowded into New St. James Church of Christ to find out more about Saturday's investigation in Salas, where 24-year-old Cedric Sharkey was found shot in the woods following a chase on Atala Road 4106. Hey, no business, no business, no chasing behind the Somebody taking the law your own Investigators say 52-year-old Frankie Barber and 42-year-old Barry Ware are charged with a fatal shooting. One weapon is being processed. The two told investigators Sharkey fired at them first, but no other weapon has been found. It has revealed up to this point in time. We do not believe he had a weapon. Residents asked questions and voiced concerns that while four were seen in the truck chasing Sharkey, only two were charged. Relatives say Barber accused Sharkey of stealing iron from his property, then later chased his car, causing it to crash. Frankie, his son, his son-in-law, his daughter, they pulled up. The son jumped out and um, said, y'all been the one taking our stuff. And said younger brother Marcus, he said, uh, we ain't been taking nothing. Some of us feel that it was, you know, I, I just, I'm tired physically, mentally, but I mean, I just want justice. You know, if it was a hate crime, I want them prosecuted to the fullest. Either way, we just want some justice. I saw it happen. And for me, for me to just see that, See the look in that man's face chasing him, I cannot get out of my head. Sheriff William Lee said the Mississippi Bureau of Investigations and several other agencies are assisting. We're going to do everything we can to make sure that we get convictions. I promise you that. You, you ain't got to worry about that part of it. If it's more evidence comes back, well, we can charge people. Charge more people, whatever. We're going to do that too. Clergy asked for fairness in solving this crime and bringing all involved in the murder to justice. Rosalind Anderson, WLBT News, Atala County. Sheriff Lee said the FBI would be consulted to determine if the fatal shooting constitutes a hate crime.